And we're back in the kitchen with executive chef Ryan Nolan from Mahoney's in Oshkosh, uh, showing us some great appetizer ideas for the New Year's. So. Yes, New Year, Packer game, Rose Bowl, anything we got. Yeah. <clears throat> you know, we're going to make a fun beef skewer that's marinated with whiskey. Mm. So, you know, if you got that little gift of, you know, wild turkey or something in the <laughs> stocking, a good way to use it. You know, I love you it. You never know. There you go. But uh, it's really simple. Uh, <clears throat> so what we started out with actually is we've got some, I use ball tip sirloin. Ball that, tip sirloin. Yeah, that we slice nice and thin, but you could use pretty much anything that you can slice pretty thin and then we're gonna basically like thread it onto a wood skewer. Okay, it's almost, so, it almost looks like a ribbon. Yeah, yeah, you so know? we're just kind of threading it back and forth just like you were mm -hmm. knitting or something, I would yeah. guess. I don't know, I never really knit before. <laughs> And if I did, I'd definitely knit beef. But. You could knit the beef. I love <laughs> yeah, it. It'd be Maybe awesome. crochet. I mean, I'd wear a beef or bacon sweater, but then again, <laughs> I'm a big fat guy, so what am I going to do? Oh, <laughs> so we're going to just thread the beef on there, kind of like that. Can I try one? Yeah, go ahead. go ahead. Okay. Yeah, so <clears throat> once we get it all threaded, we're going to want to make our marinade. Now, this marinade, you could use on chicken, but it's pretty strong stuff, so I would, I would prefer that you just see it used on beef or something like that. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna start out with about three quarters cup of some whiskey. Okay. Uh, whatever one you like or whatever one you have in the mm -hmm. liquor cabinet is perfect to use. And this is really gonna tax all of your dried spices uh, in the spice rack at home. So what we have is we have some cumin, we have some Old Bay seasoning. Old Bay is really good like in uh, chowders and things like that, but yeah. it adds a really nice background flavor. We've got some dried ginger, some dried, uh, uh, onion, garlic, a little brown sugar for sweetness, some cumin, some liquid smoke wow. to really give it that kind of outdoorsy deliciousness, and then a little bit of olive oil. We got about 11 things there, yeah, huh? Yeah. Can I help you? Yeah, dump if you want to just start adding them in, we got about a tablespoon of everything. Okay. And why don't you tell us while you whisk this all together? Sure. What do you guys have going on at Mahoney's? Anything new? Uh, well, we got you know a pretty nice New Year's Eve celebration going on. We're gonna have some food and drink specials. Mm -hmm. We've got a DJ doing some karaoke or, uh, <clears throat> as soon as the dinner service winds down. Uh, just a fun festive atmosphere. And then also on New Year's Day for the Rose Bowl, it's gonna be a good place to be. We've got some different food and drink specials for that as well too. Hey, you bet. That. Well, actually, we oh. weren't going to add that pepper, but... Oh, I am so sorry. Well, that was my fault. I should have said, reserve the salt and pepper for seasoning later, but... I am so, so sorry. So now we've now amended this recipe to whiskey pepper marinade, I so... I have just screwed up perfect. You know, the executive the... chef's appetizer. Oh, well, you know, sometimes the best <laughs> things are found on accident. You know, kind of like that guy, didn't he develop silly putty on accident or I something? I think so, so, yeah. Maybe you've come up with the next greatest thing here. I'm just going to let you do the rest of it. I'm just going to stop right. right here. And so how we... long are we marinating? Uh, you can go anywhere as low as 30 minutes to, I wouldn't go anything over four hours because it's going to get really strong in there then. Yeah. So you just uh, take your skewers then, you'd coat them in the marinade, okay. put it in the fridge and just kind of let it chill out. Take them out, season them up. Well, not pepper anymore because mm -hmm. we've got it in the marinade apparently. Right. And then, uh, so we just throw them on a grill, either a grill pan on the stove at home or fire up the grill outside for New Year's. And Delicious. Have a, have a good time eating them. Good stuff. Thanks for the great ideas. Thank you. We're going to take a quick break. We'll be right back.